Interim report on the Aswell surveillance mission. The subject was born into a family of doctors who conducted research on plagues. As well as modern medicine, he pursues knowledge in numerous other fields, including history, martial arts, fine arts, literature, and human culture. His broad knowledge and intellectual pursuits gained him entry into the organization. He contributes greatly to our group, including his research on ecological theory and artifacts, particularly those who've lost their humanity. In recognition of his deeds, he was rewarded with a seat among the Twelve, the organization's supreme decision-making body. Currently, the subject is assigned to our branch in Northern Europe, researching the evil seed phenomenon, which occurred yesterday. This ends the report. The following document contains an interaction with the subject. I have a hypothesis. I believe the evil seed was caused by what is known as the Cursed Sword, the yin to the yang of the Spirit Sword, the symbol of the Aval Organization. The fragment of the Cursed Sword, gathered by intelligence, emitted a wavelength similar to the one observed from that pillar of light. Furthermore, those filthy miscreants who deplore the human race emit the same wavelength as the Cursed Sword. In other words, individual variations aside, the Evil Seed steals the minds of those with the same wavelength, turning them into fiends. This sword dares to populate the world with fiends who threaten my beloved human race. Disgraceful, isn't it? It is. Still, that abominable evil seed has sparked an idea in my mind. But let's leave that aside for the moment. In regards to the cause of the evil seed, hmm, if my hypothesis is correct, then it lies with the one who wields the Cursed Sword, the Azure Knight. That ends the report. The following document contains an interaction with the subject. At last, at long last, it is complete! I've created a prototype of a device that will be the key to freeing the human race from its shackles! That glove, you mean? This is no mere glove! Fitted with replicated fragments of the Spirit Sword and the Cursed Sword, it utilizes their wavelengths to unleash a power capable of annihilating the fiends! But... Fear not. As I stated, I'm using but replicas of fragments from the Cursed and Spirit Swords. I have not violated the organization's cause as espoused by the Oath, Death to outsiders, they who reject humanity, and to those who would wreak havoc with their power. On to the testing! <laughs> First, let's go outside and see what this device can do. <laughs> There's no cause for alarm. That filth is an outsider I captured for this very purpose. Let the experience begin. Yeah! 
everything seems to have worked perfectly. However, more power is needed to produce the key. What is this key? <laughs> Why, it's the key to my plan to save the human race, of course. In time, this glove will produce it. But, alas, that moment isn't now. I need to find a way to increase its output. Ideally, I would create a wavelength close to that of the evil seed. But using fiends like those we encounter does not generate enough power. But no matter. <laughs> we can worry about the methods later. That aside, I think it's time you knew about my plan to save humanity. It has no doubt been on your mind, correct?